Let us solve question number 23 guys. So what we have here. If the solubility product of AB2 is 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 11 molar cube, then solubility of AB2 in pure water is dash into 10 to the power minus 4 moles per liter. Assuming that neither kind of ion reacts with water. Okay. So how will we go about it? So we have AB2 giving you A2 plus plus 2B minus. Now if I write the equation for solubility product over here, so what will be the equation for solubility product? It will be Ksp is equal to 4S cube, right? So what is Ksp? Ksp is 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 11. 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 11. This is equal to 4 into S cube. So as I solve this, what will I get? S cube is equal to 8 into 10 to the power minus 12. So S is equal to 2 into 10 to the power minus 4. So the answer is 2 guys. Okay. Very simple question. Straightforward. Apply the formula and solve it. So this is 2. Okay. Let us solve question number 24. The atomic number of unil unium. Right. So what is unil unium guys? If I know this. That is, I can write a symbol for this. What is the symbol for this? Symbol for this is U, N, U. According to IUPSE, what does U stand for? U stands for 1. N stands for, that is nil, that is 0. And again U, so U stands for again 1. So the answer to this question is what? It is 1, not 1. Hard to believe but very easy question and if you have studied periodic table well, you can easily write the answer to this. So let us solve question number 25. That is the last question. What we have? The rate of a reaction decreased by 3.555 times when the temperature was changed from 40 degrees Celsius to 30 degrees Celsius. The activation energy of the reaction is Take R equal to 8.314 joules per mole per Kelvin. LN 3.555 is 1.268. Okay. So what we have over here is this question is based on RNS equation. Just that here they have mentioned decreased. So if by degrees of 10 degrees, it is decreasing by 3.555. So if you are increasing by 10 degrees, it will also increase by 3.555. So basically what is given to us what is given to us, they have given us K2 by K1, which is how much? Which is 3.555, right? What is temperature T1? Temperature T1 is 303 Kelvin. Temperature T2 will be how much? 313 Kelvin, okay? So I have K2 by K1. I have T1, I have T2. Simply what I have to do is substitute them in the equation. What is the equation? Ln K2 by K1 is equal to Ea by R 1 upon T1 minus 1 upon T2. Let us substitute the values. 3.5 phi phi is equal to ea is what we have to calculate 8.314 1 upon 303 minus 1 upon 313 so if i solve the entire thing what do i get log of 3.555 is 1.268 right so one point 268 is equal to 
ea upon 8.314 so this is 10 upon 303 into 313 so the value of ea will be how much the value of ea on solving this you will get it as 99980.7 joules per mole do we want the answer in joules per mole guys let's see okay activation energy in kilojoules per mole they are asking we don't want the answer in joules per mole we want it in kilojoules per mole so this is 99.98 kilojoules per mole so that is our final answer guys so 99.98 so that was the last question of this session guys i wish you all the best for all your future endeavors